why does the sea smell like that? Phytoplankton die, break down and are gobbled up by bacteria and produce those gases that we smell in the sea breeze. The bacteria in our tummies do the, exactly the same thing. So really it's just bacteria farting. Bacteria farts, you could call it that, <laughs> plankton farts. One of the gases we're really interested in is called dimethyl sulfide. When it's in the atmosphere, it reacts with radicals that eventually turn into tiny dust particles or aerosols. And these aerosols scatter the sun's incoming energy away from the earth, but they can also produce climate cooling clouds that reflect the sun's energy. So it's really important in natural climate cooling. If it's a climate cooling gas, could plankton farts save the earth? Sadly not. We're never going to counteract the effects of the greenhouse gases. By improving our knowledge of the impact that DMS has on climate, it helps to reduce the uncertainties in climate models. We obviously have some understanding of how much warming is going to happen, but there are big error bars on the cooling. Would it improve the accuracy then? Yes. Wow. So where are you off to on this expedition? <laughs> We're heading out into the North Atlantic. This time of year, the phytoplankton is just kind of blooming into life. We will see a strong production of these gases. How does it feel doing this research? It can be easy to feel quite hopeless in the face of climate change. Working in an area of research that contributes to our understanding of the climate gives me kind of some sense of empowerment. I feel like I'm contributing to the climate change effort.